also known as my son, did book a role on ABC. And I am so proud of Bentley and his career. I know that there is so much more to come and that is what we look forward to. I was very intentional when I met Bentley because I knew he was a star. I felt it in my soul. And it's like in life, some things choose us. We don't choose it. I love her. She's liking wet food. So I want to do a little wet over the dry to help her. I'll literally look how small she is. Why don't we do a little montage of our first two days together? I'll say that I'm literally leaving. Today, I really feel like God blessed me with my motherly instincts because I started to have all these thoughts about parenting. Where that derived from was, I was trying to make sure I want to name her Billy Joe. Cause with Bentley, I feel like I very quickly chose his name and I didn't really give it much thought. And I was just like, I want it to be a B name so we can be like bees. With Billy Joe, I'm like, I honestly feel like we shouldn't choose a child's name, honestly. It really sets the tone and the vibe for your life. I really want to allow my children to be free thinkers. We like set the standard for children that we're adults and we know everything. I know people that are like 55 and they still don't know that much. I'm like totally just like so free and open now that I hope you can feel good energy and good vibrations. What do you think about my outfit? Oversized, I've got to do a haul because when I was in Atlanta, my cousin is a manager at a thrift store. I like got the hook up down to the ground. I haven't brought these Celine Sunnies out in a while, probably like a year. What do you think of my nails? I'm trying something different every day now because monotony is like, I would literally rather than like be in a monotonous environment. Whatever you want, we got what y'all need. Hi, my name is Brooke Pearson. CEO of Prada Poodles. Oh my God, I can introduce her on a commercial like this. Hi, my name is Brooke Pearson, CEO of Prada Poodles. Drinking water from McDonald's. Vlog, I'm scared of vlog. Yeah, right, 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 right. Well, thank you, say hi. I'm at the Grove, pretending like I'm famous. I'm blessed and honored to go through this life. Why did God choose me? I don't know. I'm back at home, left the Grove. That was real cute. While I was gone, I went to Atlanta for like a month. It was supposed to be one week, turned into a month. Excuse me. Anyway, I hit up this thrift store. I picked up a few pieces. My cousin hooked me all the way up. So I just want to show y'all. This is the first piece. It's like a little oversized tan blazer. And I'm really obsessed with these oversized blazers. Now I'm into getting like extra, extra, extra large. So I'm really into this. I never do anything underneath. It's very free, very flowing. This is blazer number two, super oversized. I gotta get the sleeves tailored, but I'm so into how big these jackets are and it's giving really good shoulder. You know I'm about a shoulder and all of these have a good shoulder in them and I'm so into it. It's giving Chris and I got two kids now. I think this would be a good time to go ahead and throw in his first debut television role. Who's perfect on ABC? This is getting very much momager. Bentley auditioned for his first role and booked it, child. I'm gonna roll that clip for y'all because I wanted to show it in the last video, but it didn't correlate. And I'm very proud of Bentley. He did win. We breed nothing but winners in abundance in this house, okay? Are you my best friend? Here he is. Oh, oh. A straight line is a straight line. Uh. I really wanted to give you as many shapes as I could, so we did quite a lot of triangles. He's got several down his back. You are obviously very, very accomplished in being very precise, and I can see that here. It's really beautifully done. I know as a guru how hard it is to get those edges. Me gusta. Let me go to the third look. Hold on, don't move. I wanted to do something really clean and really neat with a little length. I'm super into this. Now this one wasn't so big, but it does have a nice, good shoulder. Pair this with a white slack for the summer. It's gonna be real cute. So this was a really big blazer, super big. I went to a tailor up the street from my mama house and I had her 
slice it. Perfect. Yeah, perfect. So it's very cute. Shoulders at all times. This is a good Gabby moment. But this is the last one. No, yeah, this is the last one. This is Gabby. I think this was actually a dress or a shirt. I can't remember. This red was screaming everything. It's giving a nice, good, chunky gold necklace or some pearls draped over. And I wouldn't wear these. I would wear something like something cleaner because this got all type of rips and stuff. This is real classy. This is a classy girl. And I would wear them with these gouches with the front. Absolutely. I'm so sorry that I've been gone. But let me say this right now. I'm back. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe for more exclusive content. You are watching the book of Brooke. I got a lot of things coming. I hope you guys really enjoyed meeting my daughter. Congratulations again to my boy. And I'll see you next time, baby. This is the first time I've ever finished out a vlog. You see what I'm saying? I love my new house. I love my mom. She's so rich. Yeah.